everyone, my name is Dragonheart the Prince of Wales and welcome back to the Carcassonne campaign. I believe this is part 11. And we're at war with Estalia. We took Bill Bali in the previous episode. We've been very dishonorable. The dishonorable, honorable Dragonheart. That will be the name of this campaign. We also um, took out the Wood Elves because they were just there and being annoying. We are, however, at war with uh, Argalon up here, so we'll be marching my army by the Fey Enchantress, moving that up through canals and up there and then taking that out as well. Just want to get rid of some of these tree-hugging people because they're doing my head in. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the campaign, guys. I still am, which is obviously a good thing. Income is okay. Doing okay, which is good. And we are at the end of turn phase. So what we'll do, we'll end turn and we'll crack on with it. I, I did release a video probably last week now by the time this gets uploaded. Uh-oh, Estalia have big stacks. Oh, dearie me. I didn't think they had that many units, so that's just going to be impressive. Our hands prosper under your chivalrous rule. Yet evil still breeds in every corner. Many look to destroy Britonia, and their power grows as quickly as your own. Stave off their advances and unite the banners of Britonia through your chivalric actions. Lovely. 400 chivalry, 5,000 in the treasury, I'll take that. Pimples and brown spots, I can quarantine, lose income, lose growth. I'll lose growth. Chapter objective issue, I've got to get 600 chivalry. Nice. What I was going to say, guys, before that came up on the screen then, was this video I'm going to talk about probably went up last week, but I just want your feedback on the campaigns and how you find things. I have a, I have a kind of uh, knack of not completing campaigns, because it, it basically because it takes so long to produce videos. You really think you, you try to do like daily uploads every weekday for multiple campaigns. When you think about the time it takes to record... Edit, render, upload, especially with poor upload speeds, especially when you're working a full-time job like I am. Uh, you know, it's very, very challenging. I don't have the ability to do this as my job like many other YouTubers in the Total War scene have as a luxury. So, obviously, it makes things a bit difficult for me. I'm going to move her up to Canals for now. So, that's the challenge that I currently have. What I said in that video was, would you prefer to see me sort of turn some of these campaigns, mainly for when Warhammer 2 comes out, to a sort of stream-based thing, so I'll have a bit more time to do it and get more done in, in a few hours on a stream than perhaps in a, a recording session doing this. So, it's just kind of your thoughts. All I want is your feedback, basically. Okay, Estalia, this. up 9, I'll ignore that. 20, they got a full stack. Protector of the realm. 18. When they get uh, uploaded. Uh, recruited, rather. Bill Barley's got peasants. Oh, God. Gonna get absolutely trashed, I think. Don't know. We'll have to wait and see. Could upgrade Carcass Zone. Actually, I was gonna do something here, wasn't I? Oh, which faction? Uh, was it Canals? I believe it was. Was it Royal Stables to get Pegasus Knight's Armory? I believe it was. Let's get it then. Get an Armory here. And then we've got to get that up to a Pegasus Airy. I get that. I get my Pegasus Knights and I'll be happy. I'll be happy as Larry. Right, uh, that's good. You're going to go north and going to take on the Waterfall Palace. I'm going to have to try and defend against Astalia. But I think once we defend Blessings here, as long as I'm successful, I do have a... Damsel here as well, a spellcaster. I keep her in the army though. Once I've done that, I can then go for Magrita and Tabaro. I just want to consolidate this and make them big income buildings for me. Get as much income as I can, level them up. Because I can't take these stuff here, and I can't take these Chris uh, Dwarven Realm sort of stuff. I might go for Talea, I don't know yet. Do they still exist? I should probably check that first. Yeah, they do, Talea. They've only got two, and they've got, they've got nothing going on for them at all. Okay, we're rank six, so what other factions? Empire's still strong, rank four. Widrioth are a nine. Torgavan are a ten. Talia are eleventh. The ones we took out is Stalia. Would they want 
You come bearing no. arms. Of course they wouldn't if I could land. Not much else I can do this turn, so we'll just end it for now. Which is good. Ending the turn. I serve the Lady of the Lake. Do one Leonka. I do not want your defensive alliance. I wish for you to join with me and hold my hand. Okay, they're gonna attack. Of course they're gonna attack. With both armies. Now auto resolves against me, so I'm gonna be fighting this. I hate control large armies. Oh my Okay, that's pathetic. Right, we'll fight this. I am slightly up against it. I have no siege equipment either. I'd like to have had a trebuchet or catapult or something, but I don't, so it makes it a little bit more harder. I do have some good cav that I can use on their missiles. Keep that in mind. I do out-cav them. They've only got one. Okay, we'll gamble and hope for the best. That worked out really well. I do have Alberic here. Right, let's work on a formation to begin with then. Okay, let's just get all the cav out my way for now. Let's get my way, just get by there. Same with all my bows. Get my way for now. Okay, infantry. By the lady. My lord. Those thin lines are a bit of a concern. I think we'll we fill them up slightly. Most weirdest formation ever. Yeah, I centered a bit more. We do have legendary lords and stuff in center as well to help out. Okay, missiles. You're gonna screen basically. You're gonna hold position quite tightly behind. You're gonna be on skirmish. So you can fire in front of you. I'm gonna have to be quite aggressive with my cab in this battle. They're going to be quite tightly put together and grouped like that. I think that's everyone. It is. I should have a couple more units coming in from behind, I think. We'll see. Okay, wish me luck, guys. Okay, they've come to me. I go to them. That's what we're doing. I'm gonna work it like this. See those uh, pistoliers, missile cav? I'm gonna wipe them out. Two of you. I'm gonna go in aggressively with the cav. I got cavalry, it's probably my biggest strength. Matter of fact, Lance is up, take him out. And you two push on. We're gonna have four on that one there. And I want you two to go straight for the crossbowman on the side. Okay, my two lords are on there. Hell, my calves has gone all over the place. The thing is, my calf can't stay in a long ass combat here. As you can see, so get the hell out of there. All of you just get out now. Chase after them for me instead. Scare them. Kind of working. Orders, my lord. Well, well, right, the good news is. Knights of the realm, remember your vows. Immediately, hide them down. 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 Cut them down. Yes. Gotta get those calves off me. We fight for Britannia. Right, you two, 
Shoot them too. You too. Shoot that one. You. Shoot that one. Need to pull you all back. They got such a big clunge of troops there, it's annoying. Just shoot the shit out of them. Shoot the shit. On to glory! Glorious battle! Like, their lord is like fucking off by here. Even and win. Like right, you just shoot that pack for me. That's not real. That's good, right. Go on down for me. Go on, you French idiots. They're actually quite well. Up against an army that dwarfs me as well. Two armies. This will be the biggest win in the campaign so far, I think. Where's he gone? Damsel! Your skill. Help out the center here. Go for a rear charge. Kill that general for me. Let's serve our leash. Cavalry's gonna win this for me. This is why cavalry's so fucking good. I love cavalry. If you use cavalry effectively, you can fight up against large amounts of armies like this and do so much damage. We've bloody won this, I think. We've got troops coming back though, so you can turn. You can chase up there. Right, you need to group in on these. You need to push on. Literally, just keep rugged and everything. Obviously, they got reinforcements coming in, so I have to be a bit careful here. I actually want you guys to turn. If she can come up and protect. None of my reinforcements have actually made it to the battlefield yet, have they? Oh, maybe they have, I don't know. Run, you pig crossbowman. You little pigs. Run my pigs. Right, Cav. Change direction and charge all M for me. Uh, should win this. I think there's something wrong if we don't win this now. Try to keep my troops not too spread out, you know, too much. You require magic. Shit, we could pistol ears, but we have to get a cavalry. Helmut Higwathun, whatever that guy's name is. Thing is, his confidence is a bit shaken. I'm ha I'll happily take out the rest of the army first if I have to. Matter of fact, go up there. My damsel go on to him first. All of you go in on him. You require blood magic. I believe we do. March you all a bit. Shoot that swordsman, I think it's coming back. I can't see a lot of these coming back. How many have we killed now? Look at that, bloody hell, I've only lost half my troops, not even half. They've lost. 
over 2000 or near 2000. We're all jumping in on this one now. There we go, he's gonna go now. Once he goes, they all take a hit by all these halberdiers that are coming in. I want all of you to be in a position where you can reinforce. Pick up that rock for me, please. Two of you are quite fresh, so I'll send you guys in next. Uh, if I aim about there. Bollocks. That was a waste. That's not the realm. Hurry up and die, come on. Okay, missiles, do you think? Shoot that one for me. The one behind. Oh, we are. Lots and lots of crossbows. We're going to cut them off by going for the crossbows. We'll have one to go for the this back and want to go for the middle one. A damsel. Push up. Those halberdiers could make a difference. I do have Albrecht still on the battlefield, just having some time here. Actually, do I have any cav I can spare? Matter of fact, I think I do. I have some form of troops on here. Shit. How much did we get in by? Oh god. Look at the back. Nuts of the real. My cab should have routed these. Father the lady. Lady in waiting. Shit in hell. Go for the Halberdier Shirk, they're the nearest ones. I'm hoping all of you will run off. Else we got yet? Or bows? Get them up. Okay, was barely any of you. Nats of the real. Come on, rout your shits. My general's still alive. Yours isn't. I am winning this battle. I just need more of them to drop. Go for the crossbow, and the more of them we can get the route, the better. Obviously, oh, damage is staying. Keep shooting them ones then. Shooting that one for me. I want you to help out against this halberdier this year. You can dive in. You can come up and shoot the shit with me. Keep us pistol ears off me as so long as possible. Get the carve out because we've got halberdiers. The spearmen. Don't want that. Right, you can uh, take out those crossbowmen for me now. You peasants can turn. As you're gonna shoot the shit with me. Take out the crossbowmen. I have more troops coming back. Just chase anything down now. Albrecht's back. Let's have a bit of a morale boost. Turn you around. You can assist by shooting them. We won this. Nip and tack though, bloody hell, we're gonna have to take a few turns to replenish this, I think. Chasing off those pistoliers though. Alright, they're all starting to go now. Surely that's it. Yeah, that's forward. Oof. I have cab left, so I'm gonna use it. You're chasing someone. 
go chasing someone. Go chasing. You are not. Chase down the Fabadiers for me. You are. You can chase down them. And you. Yeah, chase them down. Fast forward that, that'll be enough. I'll try and get as many kills as I can. Just try and wipe out as many troops as possible. Although I think that'll probably be enough. Yeah, that'll be enough. Got it in the end. That was a nice battle though, wasn't it, folks? They did outnumber me by quite a bit. 3,000 to just over 1,000. 3 to 1 and we still beat them. Some of those cavalry kills. 300 kills in that one. Bloody hell. And this is why I love cavalry. Back at zone. Nice bit of loot. Ransom. I lose chivalry by doing that. Let's get a unit replenishment. Because we do need a bit more replenishment. And I'm hoping that I can probably defeat them in an offensive battle now next episode. Nice little battle to have, though. Banner gate, armor piercing, lovely. Let us, uh... Oh, what's going on? Of he has leveled up. I can't get camping map. Let us get... I don't even know what to give him. Mountain. Hmm. Mount barded warhorse, maybe. Charge bonus. That's just for him, though, isn't it? Uh... Charge of cavalry, let's get for the cab instead, because we're going to be using cav quite a lot. Ah, we've recruited quite a bit here, or we've replenished a fair number of stuff currently because of that. She's leveled up as well. Uh, I've given her the income. Additional damage caused her income from all enemy buildings. Strong with 120 or above. Increased power reserves. Armor piercing and damage, that's going to be good. Amber spear we're going to get. And that is where we'll end the episode. So next turn now, or next episode rather, we will be attacking these armies head on with Alberic. Trying to defeat them and get a clear path then to take on the rest of Estalia and take all this land for myself. But I'm going to end today's episode here. I've been Dragonheart the Prince of Wales. Thank you for watching. Until next time, goodbye.